Watu wangu mara nyingine ni mshaba Marekani America spoon feeds you So niwi my wish ni nyinyi mkuje mkuje nyu wote I'm telling you America is going to spoon feed you Unta ku spoon feed pesa Okay America ita ku spoon feed pesa the system is set up when your system iko it set up wewe ku succeed Imagine, imagine kama kama mtoto amezaliwa kwenye kuna mali. Unaelewa? They, their life has already been set for them to succeed. Na hivyo ndio Marekani iko. That's why a lot of people who are very very successful. Okay, immigrants wana wako huko Marekani they own businesses. In fact, most of the business unaona hata zenye ziko online, immigrants na wamezi create waindi manaijo wame create ma business wase wametoka Iran wame create ma biashara huku hizi hizi all these digital businesses unaona unaelewa hizo 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 manini ma articles uh, ma software all those companies startup companies hizo vitu zote zime developiwa na muslim migrants that's why america inapenda migrants so you can imagine umesoma ama wewe ni mjanja na uko na akili then you are put in a place where unaambiwa you know what ndio hii mambo ni kama ni kama wewe ni mse wa, wa unapenda soka okay unawekwa kwa hizo favorite team zako unajua kucheza soka na nini unaenda unawekwa huko hizo team na supporting hizo team mbili sijui Manchester na Arsenal unaenda unawekwa huko unawekwa kwa line up na unaambiwa unaelewa tutakutrain hapa tutakutrain venye utaenda alafu tutakuanga kwa line up unacheza tutakupea mshahara so think about it that way yani wana ku equip na everything una need so america ita ku spoon feed uh, one of the way ita ku spoon feed ni at uh, there are so many pads kuna njia mingi za kutumia marekani na oh, all zina, zinapatana place moja ni kutengeneza pesa so there are so many pads unaweza tumia na zote ziko geared towards the same the same the same goal to make money na ku improve your life okay so the main path watu wengi wanatumia ni kuenda shule if you go ukienda shule marekani and you study something in the stem science techno, technology engineering mathematics iso you study anything along those lines and you graduate your life is going to be set Once you graduate, you end up internship and you get hired, your life has in a change. Na hautakosa kazi. Okay, that is one path. Now that is ile path most Americans wametumia kwa wealthy, okay? Because now when you have income na kazi, you'll be able to get a mortgage, you'll be able to buy a car, you'll be able to save money, utaweza kupewa maloni na bank you start businesses if that's what you want and you or you can save invest even in the stock market so that is a sure path and you, when you're comfortable na uko na pesa poa na pesa enough you be able akili yako inafikiria vizuri because hakuna hizo vitu mabarias okay so your one path you naweza follow just that one path and you are you are set hakuna ati atusome au graduate afu anze kutama why opportunities are so many okay so and there is other parts kama hizo za trade school plumbers plumbers they make a lot of money hata kuliko nurses carpenters wana make pesa mingi kuliko nurses okay you go kama hizo trade school wana kufundisha hizo plumbing uh, hvac is your heating and ventilation because america heating and ventilation is a big thing okay na my office is hotted they have to be cooled maske hawa ikiwa cool especially during summer unakuwa very hot kufungua dirisha isaidi so these offices inahitaji kukuliwa when it comes to summer people need to warm their houses because of the extreme weather baridi mingi so hizo vitu zote ziwaribika they need servicing zinahitaji kuwekwa uh, plumbing so many apartments in a building all these people wanaharibu wana hizo ma plumbing zinakuwa blocked 
carpenters their houses being built every day watu watu wanazaana kwa wingi kama hapa napita kuna nyumba ina construct so many constructions going on because they need housing so guess what plumbers carpenters electricians those are pads unatumia na trades within within a, a year or so usha train you na uko kwa kazi construction barabara za marekani zinatengeneza ngo every other day everywhere you go in any city utakosa construction inaendelea barabara that is another part what we need to meet trade school because not everybody that are going to college because college sometimes ina kujanga na malons you pay afterwards that's another way they spoon feed you unapoa pesa college and they, they so they will make sure unaona ukimaliza college you get a job and you pay that pesa but they're telling you he is the money go to college but you have to pay so the other trade school unaona they're going to equip you there are so many trade school marekani okay it's it's up to you you decide so it's not like you can do the bare minimum and you still succeed okay you can do the, the bare minimum and still succeed you hata unaweza sema utasoma uh, you don't want none of that na utafuta tu kazi ya housekeeping and you focus on it now you fanye many hours and you will come on top and succeed marekani it's just the system is set for you to succeed okay kuna ups and downs but tuna stick to that the main thing at it ukiweka mind yako hapo uta succeed sio wenye watu wanasema oh put your mind in something una put your mind kitu hata ukichapa hizo hesabu hizo hesabu in that business you will never make a lot of money watu wanakuambia work hard kwa ofisi na tusema unalipwa tusema unalipwa 5000 za Kenya how can you at work work hard you can't be paid more than hiyo pesa <laughs> unaelewa if mshahara wako ni 5000 a month even if you work hard aj mshahara ni ile 5000 so mwenye mwenye ana do the bare minimum na work hard you still come unalipwa the same amount of money so but marekani you work hard you take more hours unaweza come on top you can earn more money because you work extra home if you work extra ukikaa ofisi past the hours probably utalipwa sababu unalipwa na mshahara so you are the one losing but marekani you step you stay one hour past ile time unafaa kuwa ukilipwa you still getting paid by the hour so you can see time is your friend the more time you put in the more unapata okay but kazi za mshahara saa zingine we unalipa salary at the end of the month the more time you put in the more you are losing because you're not getting or get compensated but now kazi unalipa na mshahara power the more hours you put the more you get paid okay ndio utaona kuna watu wanafanya CNA na wamepita mshahara za nurses why they are putting in more hours okay they are putting in more hours kuna watu wana kazi mbili tatu so there is money there is money to be made uh, there is a life changing opportunity ndio mimi nasema nga ni watu mkaweza kukam it would be very nice It'd be very nice uh, apart from all the challenges everywhere dunia kuna ma challenges ai come on kuna challenges kila mahali there is bills to be paid there is so many things that challenge people but when you know at you step out of the house you can get a job and you start earning there's so many jobs kama saa hizi nikienda hapo mpaka unaingia anga unaona wamesema we hire talk to the manager right now utakuwa hired on the spot saa hizi nikitaka kazi saa hizi there's so many places hapa na jua au go and apply na nita hiyo siku nitaanza kazi na watanilipa hiyo siku because some of them they are paying you they are paying you uh same day now squeeze work on a system they can ukiwapea details zako wataangalia waangalie hata background they see all those people come up authorize kufanya kazi and all that and in a clear they don't have to wait siku mingi okay and they can pay you as as you wait for them to clear those things okay so kazi ziko and you start getting paid is changing opportunities most of the successful immigrants marekani ni africans Kenyans, Kenyans Americans they are very successful. 
okay? Usidanganyo na anybody. Kenyans, Americans are very successful. They have a lot of money. Do you know how much Kenyan Americans want to remit back home? Wana to me a pesa. Well, Kenyan American machali wako na tusai chiki. Kama kumi. No, and that will be a Kenyan who Jeribu Kongera Kadem. I can't be, oh, I'm dating a guy, he's in the USA. Yeah, because I'm at a good day, Mata is going to twice. Madame Wengu and I'm, I know it's very frustrating for guys who are Kenya, Madame Ejiako in their 20s. Now, Kuna Kituna is a Moambia. Sababu, all of them are going to boyfriend in the US, and these guys' money is nothing to them. That is a big problem. Okay, so. They are, they, are, they, are, they, are, they are people who Kenya, they, they are so many professionals, they are very successful. They, they, they are doctors. They got, when Kuna wa Kenya ma truck drivers, wana pesa hata kuliko ma daktari. Okay, Kuna wa Kenya wana own fleet, zama trucks. Very successful. That is something they would have never done when you were home. Not because of anything, because pia, pia the system itself the system itself and also lazima the structure of the whole system lazima ikuwe intact where the system is working for the benefit of yani you as yourself as a person ukisema i want to do do this and i want to make it happen it can get done okay the banks are there to loan you the government it may create the environment for the business where it could streamline nataka kuanzisha business naenda mahali nafanya tax id nachukua tax id i register my business na naanza kulipa taxes zenye government inataka na hakuna kushinda ukisumbuliwa na mambo mingi hapa okay process iko streamline you want to start a business you follow you do this and these steps and that's it hakuna kusumbuliwa mingi Okay, kama ni permits inatakikana ni easy. Kama ni ku renew the the the, the, the nini mia. So anybody starting a business, they know this is what we need to do because the system iko set up hivyo sio kusumbua watu. Mtu anataka kuanzisha business and anasumbuliwa na mambo mingi. No, imeandikwa. You want to start a business? Okay, you register a business. Enda uchukue tax ID. Uh, kuwa na location. Enda uchukue permits. Kama unapika enda uchukue permits nini nini za ku, za kudistribute chakula and all that na zote ziko places you go una zilipia this is how much you going to pay for it this is how much you going to get charged ikifika tax season you do the taxes this way the government want a piece of this and that's it is streamlined so even if you're trying to succeed you're not having to think mazeni nani nita bribe ai hii biashara nitakufungua hapa nitafanya nini no there's nobody to bribe you just go follow what the system is telling you and you you once you do that, Kenya wana taka, you'll be able to start your own stuff. So, the process is very streamlined for people to be successful, individuals. So, wa Kenya wengi wako successful, there's so many realtors wako wa Kenya, uku wana, wana uza manyumba, something they would have not been able to make a living from. Kuna wa Kenya wana own maranch, uku. Okay, wana own large, large chunks of land. Kuna wa Kenya wana lima. Kuna Kenya wana own uh, izo zinaitu ango adult family home. And most of them wana leta over, over 2 million a month. To over 2 million a month. Okay? Kuna wa Kenya wakona izo fleet is ama trucks. They are making millions. So why? The system is here to benefit you. Nandiyo tumesema uke remit izo. Wa Kenya wana remit pesa mingi. Where do you think that money is coming from? the system itself it may in ensure people are able to make a living okay are able to succeed if they want without succeed if you're okay with the bare minimum the system is set for you so the system is set to, to spoon feed you so make me i i hope you guys mnajua green card iko karibu go apply Jaribu njia zote sio kuhepa home you're not running away from home <laughs> kwa mtu atanaanza kuku guilt you're not running away from home you are just looking for a better opportunity when you unaweza toka Gishagi uende Nairobi kutafuta kazi 
okay you can't run away from kwenye umetoka uangalia wa Kenya wanajifanyanga they run away from Kenya mpaka mtu anasema mpaka mpaka kiombo anasema oh my god dear god we are praying you si mnajua hapo anajifanya oh eh heberi zinyu mimi ongea Kiswahili oh oh Kiswahili wametoka Kenya you're running away from tunakusikia you can run away from where you come from okay no matter ugo ndo kujaribu ku fake hakuna ku run away itakachap na wewe so you're not running away you're just looking for better opportunities and there's nothing wrong with that okay there is nothing wrong with that so you guys apply those green cards okay uh, na kuna watu watasema kuna watu walikuwa nauliza if you're making this amount of money do you need to come to us so kenya mina is a semani ati uh sometimes if you're making a good all these things zote mi usema okay all these things they are ziko tailored kwa individual okay it's not a one size fits all so what naweza kuambia if you're making uh kama una make kama 1100 za Kenya okay and you're comfortable na una meet needs zako okay you are comfortable unaelewa elfu moja Kenya you are comfortable with it aina haja kukuja marekani but mimi sikuambi usikuje marekani usiseme mshamba wa watu ambia usikuje marekani si wewe ukuje si wewe utoke marekani no mimi siambi mtu hivyo what naweza kuambia ni kama kama una make hizo pesa it's good utembee marekani saa zilichukua ka, ka vacation ukipata hata visit visa wetembea tu and you just see ongea na watu see how how they are paying for their vehicles manyumba taxes the lifestyle the weather then you make a decision you make a decision based on that you yourself make a decision based on your own experience okay sababu my experience naweza kuambia and it might not be your experience kuna mkenya atakwambia experience yake ever since i learned another grade kwenda marekani okay uh, kuna mkenya anakuambia they don't regret anything if they were to do it again they would do it again so these experiences mtu anaweza kuambia things to encourage you or discourage you but it's based on their own and and that is their own truth ju kama mtu mtu alika marekani uh, maybe uh, things happen ka fall in trouble kusumbuana na watu nini uh, maybe things happened vitu mbaya zikamhapenia they have a different story about the place maybe they went ba- bankrupt uh, maybe they had, they got a nice job and they lost their job they lost the houses the, the wife and the kids the experience is going to be very different so whom to akikwambia about marekani atakwambia based on that experience because kama marekani sasa hizi kuna watu wako homeless there are even kenyans who are homeless their story is going to be very different from mkenya ako successful so it is very very good you get your own experience gather information from watu wanakuambia sikiza hawa sasa wanakuambia life about marekani is not what you think at the same time look at those who are telling you okay there is opportunities and you can be successful then you draw a balance then you find a way and try experience it for yourself so that utasema mimi nikikwambia hapa kama nina vaa viatu ni vai i can hizo viatu naweza sema they are comfortable they are not hata nikikwambia hizi viatu ni comfortable where you cannot always jua sababu miguu sio the same unaweza vaa hizo viatu sema this are the most uncomfortable shoes in my life na mimi nikivaa nasema oh my hizi oh hizi viatu ni ni poa kuna mtu anapenda suti akivaa suti ana feel ako fresh maybe mtu mwingine anataka kuvaa tu ka jacket kama mshamba and you are comfortable so it's your own experience and but you get an opportunity ya kwenda marekani sianze ujinga tio i have a boyfriend i have a girlfriend oh i see him watch you know we are so in love we are so in love i can't leave him you know you pussy kuja 
take your take that step ender okay uh and you will not regret okay the kumalizia they are they are sacrifices of course in everything okay so you you sometimes you utapata pesa and you sacrifice a lot of things that is what marekani is is mostly about you're gonna have to sacrifice especially like when you migrate you sacrifice family time being away from family you're gonna miss uh events and a lot of time with family and being in your home country on the other hand you're gonna benefit from getting the money okay so sometimes you're gonna miss out doing living life because you're shinda kazi to get the money so there are those sacrifices you're gonna have to make okay in order to get kenya unataka so but they are, they're gonna spoon feed you most of the kazi yuku ukisomea tusema unasomea kazi ya ndege um unasoma ama nursing ama whatever kazi unasomea ukienda kazi it's completely different from kenya ulisomea unaelewa it's completely different they have their own way of doing things uliza hata manases ukienda kufanya kazi it's not what you studied okay so and most jobs they are going to train you so what to